Oh my god. Hey, hey, kill him! Take off his head! Oh, what? <laughs> Bro! Okay, so guys, we are at Comic Con right now. Bo's invited me out to go to the House of the Dragon interactive experience. Peter, I have a couple of cool questions for you. You're a big Game of Thrones fan, right? No. Okay, do you trust <laughs> Littlefinger? Who? Who should have ended up on the Iron Throne? H Hodor. What does Hodor mean? Uh, the, something about the door. VIP club. Hey, how do you guys feel in your little VIP box right now? Loving it. Kevin, why are you not here? Why are oh, you not, oh why sorry, let me. Oh. How are you doing today? How's that King Viserys? King Viserys? I hear he's doing quite well. And Prince Damien, you gotta watch out for him. He's a... Uh... Prince, Prince Damien is our benefactor. Prince Damien is the captain of the City Watch. Yeah. Prince Damien made sure we got all this new armor. These nice shiny gold cloaks. <laughs> We've taken on that name, the Gold Cloaks. Yeah. Prince Damon is one of my favorite people. I've met him. How is he? Like many people that are royal and high up, they are uh, they are a bit forceful. But I mean, who can blame them? They get what they want. It's just what they do. He seems very stern. It's also what he wants us to be. This city watch. He wants us to make sure that everyone's in line and everyone is doing what they're supposed to do. So the sternness carries over to us. Is the jawline as sharp as uh, the artists have portrayed him? I don't know about sharpness, but I do know about diamonds, and I know it's like a diamond. <laughs> Why are you asking so many questions about Prince Damon? Hey, Should I be worried about no, you? No, no, I'm just, I'm here just to learn a little more about him. You know, I'm on a little field trip, you know? Field I, yeah, I, I have to learn about, you know, the Targaryens, see what's going on. All right. It's my first time. Where are you from? I'm from a land very far away. It's very humid. It's called Florida. There. Is that across the narrow sea? Yes, we're House Florida Man. We're not the best known house. People don't really respect us. I've just heard of you for the first time. I, but I imagine you've got all kinds of stories. M many wild stories, but I've yet to see a dragon. Well, they tell us that there's dragons inside. Okay. I don't actually know. They don't let us go inside. It's only the dragon keepers that get to go in there. And apparently, people who want to see if they've got a little Targaryen blood. Here's the deal. If you go inside and you see a dragon and you've got a little Targaryen blood, you might just be walking away with your own dragon. Ooh. Otherwise, you might be lunch. And honestly, what a way to go. You think it's gonna bite off a finger, it's gonna bite off you. It, 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 <laughs> your whole being is just gonna go right down its gullet. If you want an idea for size, you see those claw marks. Now, I've seen those claw marks a lot. I've never seen a dragon, but I know a dragon made them. So I'm a little worried now. Yeah, I mean, I think you should be. Unless you think maybe it's a little bit Targaryen. Targaryens have been prolific. I would imagine most people have a little Targaryen. Yeah. Your friend here is a little closer to Targaryen <laughs> with the color of the hair. Sure. Yeah, I am, absolutely. If you can trick a dragon, I want to know that. I want to know that process. I don't quite get to the right color. Mine's, uh, I've been, what is it, kissed by fire. That's what they say, that's right. Are we in a market? What is going on oh, outside this, the castle? This section of Flea Bottom here, this, uh, uh, this marketplace, these stalls, we've got people from Dawn selling things, we've got a blacksmith selling wares, and then we've also got weavers over there selling whatnot. Now here's the thing about them, they're all swindlers. Okay, can I barter with them? You can try. I'll warn you though, they'll likely get the better of you. If you do well with them, maybe try the dragon. If you don't, you might want to rethink it just a little bit. <laughs> I heard you had some of the finest fabrics around. The finest fabrics yeah. around. I made them all from scratch, uh -huh. by hand myself. How long did that take? Well, it depends what you're looking at. Something like this, for example, this is horse hair. I plucked the horse myself. What's the horse's name? Barry. We've been together a long time, me and Barry. Still doesn't get used to the plucking. Goes and hides for a while. So it's been about two weeks because he runs away. I've been asked to introduce my soul to you. Everybody. This is the divorcee that divorces heads from bodies. Only the best quality here. I feel like there's a little uh, flirtation going on between you two. You're supposed to be guarding, right? Listen, listen. Flirtation, that's... Don't tell me, wife. My, wa my wife gets... She, she gets jealous. And all it is, is I'm just checking in. I'm just making sure that all the goods are all right. I'm just making sure that you're not swindling anybody. Well, you know, we are out here every day and we do get just a little friendly. Flirtatious, I think that's going too far. If you could help me get some dragon glass. I've been on the hunt for some dragon glass. Dragon glass? Yes. 
Oh, you know, we don't have any dragon glass here, but we do have the finest quality armor that you can find this side of Westeros. Will this protect me from a dragon if I have one? Oh, I don't think anything can protect you from a dragon. I'm sorry there. Do you offer any discounts for travelers? Like a traveler discount? Who's a traveler? Someone who comes from another land. Uh, well, how much you got? I got about a, a thing called a dollar. I don't know if you even take those. Uh, we yeah, we only take real coins. All oh, these what the travelers, you say? They, no one has any real coins. I don't know what you're doing. I guess people have Bitcoin. That's the type of coin that people have now. Yeah, don't accept that. Between us, you're going to get a dragon egg if you want to barter. Bring back your egg, we can work out. And she set up with different weapons because you really need a weapon when you're on in King's Landing. What is one positive thing you could say about each other? Well, I could say that. Oi, hey. you bother the people again? No. Uh, no, I ain't bothering. So that's it. I, you ain't bother me, right? And you ain't bothering no one. Is that a positive thing? You're, I ain't bothering him? Yeah, it's pretty positive. It's not a negative. Wait, what's a positive thing you can what say about him? He don't smell today. I don't smell today. I, yeah. I smell him. You just might just me, gotten you know? used to it. Like I probably am used to it, yeah. You've you got a gold coin I let you smell. <laughs> Never mind. No, no. Oh, you no, know, you come with me. Oh, you know, you're getting arrested oh, by me. Andy, Andy, help me, lad. I, I, I'll, I'll, I'll bail you out, don't worry. No, I won't bother for you, you'll be out again in a bit. I'm yeah, sure two I'm, of them I'm, are in I'm, love. I'm, I'm, hey, come on with you now. Hey, hey, kill him. Take off his head. Off with his head, I say. I'm king of the flea bottom. What are you now? I know you don't. So often, I'm pretty sure they're in love. Ah. And he's just doing it as an excuse. There's a secret hidden romance that we don't know about. Well, We're covering something today. I ain't today. saying nothing, but he nicks him a lot. It's a bit weird if you ask Does me. Does he end up with bruises around the neck? I don't know. I don't bother looking. Um, flea bottom is full of pride and dragons are over our home. Where do you get your inspiration for your songs? Oh, it's all in me head, love. <laughs> it's all in me head. I sing about everything in yeah. flea bottom. Absolutely, could, born and raised. Can we have you sing a song about, uh, are these limes over here? Absolutely. Yeah. These limes are green and delicious. I've never had one in my life. They look a little suspicious. I'll save one for me, wife. <laughs> <laughs> I so wish good. I had me a wife. Cooking clean for me. I just live in a pig's den. I have to do everything myself. If you want some spices at really good prices, come <laughs> over here today. Hello. So I, I'm in charge of picking up spices. I have to cook dinner for my girlfriend when I get back. Perfect, perfect. So wait, what do you suggest? What are we making? Huh? What do we What do we already have? That's what you got um, to see. I, I have a thing called a chicken. A chi we have chicken. Yeah, yeah. okay, chicken. okay. Okay, well, you're going to want to get a little coriander right here. Eh? Okay. Stuff the chicken. Put a little bit of turmeric on top. And then this is most important. You put it in the pot. These come all the way from the base of Dorn. We call them bay leaves. Yes, yes, you throw those in there. I'm just giving some Dornish cooking tips. I, I heard he has good deals, right? Oh, right. He's very good trustworthy deals. for the deal. He's deals. not trustworthy at all. This right here, poison. Poison? Not poison? What are you talking about? Look at, look. Uh, yum, so good. So good. <laughs> You've got to put poison it with others. Right there, but I see that myself. Zuha's doing <coughs> fine. <laughs> all right, right. All right. So you put all that in there. You boil it for about 15, 20 minutes. It's going to be delicious. You're going to want some Dornish wine. Well, the best wine in all. Scamming you out of your money here. Do you have any money? I heard a lot of travelers come here, but no money, really. Yeah, that happens. Oh, it see, it happens. you can't even sell to this man here. He has no point. I'm here to barter. That's, uh, yeah. Oh, okay, well, I offer you this deal, okay? You get Zuha, one dragon egg. I give you 50% off. One dragon egg? I can uh, a whole up. kingdom. I can be in charge of a whole kingdom if I have one dragon egg. with a little tiny dragon. I like your With a little baby, you can't get anywhere. You see the big... You think that baby dragon can do what that dragon did? I'm from the land of Florida. We have something oh, like a dragon. I could I've trade you. i that place. Men there are crazy. There's a thing called a gator. It's kind of like a dragon. There was this lady who was holding a dragon with little mm -hmm. horns earlier. I have no idea what... It was a royal dragon or something. But, but it's time to go see the dragon. It's time to go see the dragon. All right, all right, here we go. We are going into the experience now. Yeah, look at the door handle right there. It's got a dragon. Let's hear it. Are we ready for some dragons? Yeah! Are you ready? So ready. All right, we're going into a hallway. It has the smell of like fire. Stay with the group. No dawdling. 
Yes! You see 12 dragon eggs, each with a personality. You may now, with the utmost of respect to this young life, are you prepared for the challenges that await? Yes. yes. You may now reach into the fire. All right, we're approaching an egg. I guess I'm gonna go with this one. I don't want to touch it. I don't know if I'm ready to take care of a dragon. Right, well, if it does hatch. Take your egg and hold it close to your heart. They like to hear your beat. They like the warmth from your body. Okay, apparently I'm supposed to cradle the egg, hold it close to my body. I don't know if Allison is ready Why to take care of a dragon. Why some eggs hatch and others do not? This is like in school when you like take care of an egg for the day and make sure it didn't crack. This is what I'm doing. It's just a dragon egg, right? That's, this isn't valuable at all. Oh my god. <laughs> Look at the size of the dragon skull. Yo, <laughs> I'm nerded out. We are in the presence of the mighty Targaryens and dragons that came before. The power of the Targaryens is in their dragons. Valeria was the oldest creature to see Valeria at its height, ridden by Agon the Conqueror himself. Let us take a moment to hold our eggs close. I right, have to hold our egg close, bow our heads and seek guidance. Oh God, what the? Let us to Dragonstone. Ancestral home of the Targaryens and site of Dragon Vault's volcano. What? Man's talking about a volcano right now. Are we gonna throw the egg into a volcano? Yo, come on. Like, not these. They're too hot this season. I have to talk sweet nothings to it. Okay, little dragon, you're gonna do big things, okay? We're gonna conquer kingdoms, and you're gonna be beautiful and majestic, and you're never gonna get taken down by a giant arrow. Good luck. Do great things. Oh. The gods have heard our prayers. All of the dragons have passed. Many are not so lucky. Here, in the dragon set, a final test of courage is called for. Not given by me, but by the dragons lurking in the shadows. Watching your every move. Sensing your every emotion. For to bond with the dragon, you must walk amongst them without fear. Give me your hand. I would hold on tight to the rope the entire time and push on through the darkness. Be so honored to touch a dragon, do so with respect. Push on through. I don't know what I'm more scared of, having a dragon maybe or the darkness? <laughs> Both are frightening. You are. Okay, y'all probably can't see this. Uh, it is pitch black. I am scared. There are dragon sounds, and there. Oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> the walls are shaking. As a dragon eye, I'm gonna keep going. Where's the rope? Okay, what the? There's things going in the middle of my face now. Oh, the smells. Okay, the floor is just vibrating. I feel like a dragon is breathing. What is that? What is that? Oh, that's just AC. Okay, all right, we got we got another dragon right here. Keep going. Where are we now? Oh, what? <laughs> Bro. You know those like fantasies where you just, you know, you want to live out your inner nerd, nerd dream? Uh, it, is, it is about to happen right now. I'm about to uh, sit on the Iron Throne right now. This is so cool. They have live performers playing the Game of Thrones theme song. Oh, this is so cool.
My queen is currently in um Not in King's Landing, good answer. <laughs> <laughs> now the question is of the three of you, which will hold the throne with the most confidence? Obviously me. Yeah. Obviously. Yeah. I like Unanimous the vote right there. Yeah. Over here. yeah. It's a very peaceful all. time here in King's Landing. Yeah, though. I love it. Everybody's getting. You would never want a civil war Absolutely. to happen or anything. Yeah. Here. Absolutely no. not. No. no, no. We're all here for a tournament. Yes. Where we all just drink lots of ale and wine until it's all gone. There we go. So, Absolutely. what's your favorite song that the band plays? Will you play that one I like? My favorite one. I don't know what it's called. Just play it. You know. This one. Yeah. I like this one a lot. I, you know, I hear it over and over and over again. It's almost like in my my dreams. Oh yeah. You know, it's like one of those. What do they call earworms? Moment's happening. This is the, the true way you get brought up to the throne. Must always be a school. <laughs> well, it's happening. Enjoy your kingdom, sir. Oh, look at this. We're 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 just sitting on the Iron Throne right now. This is this is happening. Like, how cool is this, right? And just like that, I've been uh, voted out of office and I've been dethroned. Bye bye, dragon. I didn't want to get off, I just wanted to stay there. I recently heard of a land called York where they have so much bread, they take some of the bread out, throw it away, and they call it a bagel. Alright, so they have a giveaway, scan QR code, sound ring powered by Bose. They're going to be giving away a Bose speaker system. It's engraved with dragons. Where's right. my dragon egg? I tried to sneak the dragon egg out. Didn't work very well. I'll try to sneak you out another one. Okay. okay. Hey, as long as you keep trying, huh? That's all that matters, eh? Don't get no in your heart. Spice. Let's go buy some spice here where the price is nice. Come and buy some spice from your friend Zuha. All right, so we just finished. That was so cool. Right? It was so immersive. I, you know, I love interacting with like characters, right? And you're like learning these different storylines. That was a blast. Every single performer was so good. Then when you go through, it's such like an immersive experience, right? Dark and creepy, and like it's like you're living out your favorite fantasy, hopping on the Iron Throne. So you feel the floor shaking, you feel the dragon breathing. Bose, thank you so much for having me come out. It was a blast. I had so much fun. Okay, now guys, we're back at home. I'm still staying on the Iron Throne. I just want to say, Bose, thank you so much for sponsoring this video. Now I have been a huge fan of Bose my entire life, right? When it comes to my sound systems or my TV or the headphones that I'm using, I always go with Bose. But man, the subwoofers and speakers that they were using for this experience, I wish you could all experience it. Cause like, it shook you to your core. You felt like a dragon was right next to you and it was utterly terrifying being in the pitch black. But I had so much fun going through the interactive experience, right? I'm a huge Game of Thrones fan. But then they also had this like app that you could download that you could hatch your own little dragon. So I hatched my own little dragon and I. Uh, He's adorable. You walked out, they kind of gave you some special collectible pins. But Bose did give me a sound bar. Uh, I'm going to be sending this out to one of you guys on Patreon. I'll put a little link down below. So, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to hit that like button. And if you haven't already, hit the subscribe button. Join the family. I love the family. Because I'm going to keep you up to date on all things San Diego Comic Con and pop culture. Hi, right, guys. I love you all. Please stay safe. And I'll see you all very soon. Here where the price is nice. It's a tough decision. This is a huge relationship test right now. Who's gonna take the power? You're gonna wear the pants in the relationship? Yeah, always.